Hi, I'm Kate. And I'm Paul. In the first three videos in this series, we've learned how to choose and fit your life jacket, and what to wear to stay safe and comfortable on the water. We've also gone over a few key items that experienced paddlers bring every time they go paddling, and talked about the importance of sharing your plan with a friend who will call for help if anything goes wrong. Now, we're going to show you how to move your kayak where you want it to go in the water. You need to do three basic things in your boat. Go forward in a straight line, stop or go backwards, and turn. There's a stroke for all three. The forward stroke is the most basic and the one you'll use most of the time. Grip your paddle loosely with your hands about shoulder width apart, and if your paddle has scooped blades, hold it so the scoop side is facing you. Now reach one paddle blade toward your feet and place it in the water. Twist your body to get that reach and then twist back to pull the blade to your hips. That way, you use your core muscles and not just your arms. Don't pull too far. Anything past the hips is wasted motion. So take the blade out when it reaches your hips and repeat the stroke on the opposite side of the kayak. That's it, you're paddling. When you want to stop or slow down, place a paddle blade in the water and push gently forward, away from your body, slowing the kayak. If you're going fast, you might need to alternate sides to keep the boat on a straight line as it slows down. Backing up is the same as the forward stroke, but in reverse. Place your blade at your hips and push away from the body. When stopping or back paddling, don't spin your blades around. It's not worth the effort or confusion. Just keep the same paddle grip as before. Hands shoulder width apart, relax grip, and the scoop part of the blade facing you. Pro tip, asymmetrical paddle blades are designed to have the longest part of the blade on top. If the scoop side is facing backward and the longest part of the blade is not on top, flip it around like a helicopter. As you paddle forward, especially at first, the boat may veer off course and you'll need to use some correction strokes. If the front of your kayak veers off to the right a bit, you can use a sweep stroke on the same side to correct it. This stroke modifies the forward stroke by reaching out away from the side of your kayak, making a wide C motion with your paddle blade. This creates much more turning motion than a normal forward stroke and, used just at the right time, it'll get you right back on course. It may take some trial and error, but you'll figure it out as you go. Going straight will become second nature, but it's just not at first. So paddle around in circles for a bit, practicing these strokes, and eventually you'll get it. Those are the basic strokes to get you started. But if you want to jumpstart your learning process and take your paddling to the next level, it's a great idea to take a class. Classes are also a great way to meet other paddlers and learn about fun places to paddle. Check your local paddling shop or go online to find instructors in your area. And remember, be smart, be safe, have fun.